Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, I put a poll up the other day um, asking what shows you guys wanted to see next. Hopefully I will still do all of them but the winner of that poll was Derry Girls so I'm gonna record a few episodes of that today. Don't know when they'll be posted but guys I'm hoping this is funny because I know nothing about this show by the way just that it's Irish and it looks like it's set in like a school um, like quite a few years ago um, but I don't know anything else and I'm hoping it's funny because god knows I need it after these last few days I recorded Heartstopper season 2 on the 3rd of August binged it all um, I don't know if hopefully you'll have got all the episodes by this point um, I know I've not ep edited episode 8 yet for YouTube um, and I need to do that soon but I tried to get a head start on editing Red, White and Royal Blue for YouTube because guys I really wanted the whole three hour film of that but oh my god am I kind of glad that we only got the two hours because I'm finding it hard to edit it all down <laughs> so yeah anyway Derry Girls <laughs> um, I really need something light hearted quite funny because the last few days have been a uh, travesty. Also, um, not a travesty in a bad way, they're just, it's been a lot mentally. Um, also, sorry if you can hear the fan, it's bloody roasting in the UK for some reason. So I've got the fan on, um, hopefully it's not too loud, um, but apologies if it is. Anyways, Derry Girls, I'm excited. I love the Irish accent. I'm hoping it's Irish, otherwise, otherwise I sound stupid. But yeah, I've not. I don't know anything about it. Like I said, I just know that it's Irish, and well, I, I just, I, I think I know it's Irish, and it's set in like a school of some sort, and it's, I think it's like in the nineties, in the nineties maybe. Um, but yeah, that's about it. I don't, I've not watched any trailers. I've not, I don't know any of the characters. So this is first time reaction. But yeah, um, if you do enjoy my reactions, make sure to go out, go, Hannah, words. <laughs> if you do enjoy, oh my God, <laughs> what is going on? If you are enjoying my reactions guys, please go on over and check out my Patreon. Um, you don't have to obviously, but it's there if you want to see all my unedited reactions. Pretty much, they're all over there. So go check it out if you want to. Um, also, hit the notification bell and subscribe and leave a like and comment and let me know what other shows you want me to watch if I haven't watched them already and I could react to them. We're going to watch Dairy Girls. Um, and I know that season three is out on Friday. What day is it? Wednesday. Wednesday the 16th of August when I'm filming this. Um, so I don't know when these are going up, but season two might already, season three might already be out um, by the time you see this. And it probably will be. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoy and I hope I do. Anyway, this has been long enough. Derry Girls, season one, episode one. Let's go. My London name Derek. is Erin Quinn. I'm 16 years old and I come from a place called Derry. Or London Derry, depending on your persuasion. Irish. A troubled little corner in the northwest of Ireland. Ireland. It's fair to say I'm I have a somewhat complicated relationship try. with my hometown. Right? You see, Why the thing that? about living in Derry is there's nowhere to hide. Everybody knows everybody, knows everything about everybody. Not and kind of like where I live. Sometimes much. all I really want is to be simply left alone. Right. Is that my diary? <laughs> okay. Dairy Girls. Far this time, okay. Mama. I mean, what next? Well, get your train over Knickers. Don't say Knickers in front of your father. He can't cope. I can't cope. She runs Knickers. Of knickers between cousins. Last of the Knickers. Oh, cousins. I won't put up with Macaulay Cook, who might be divorced and has parents. Do you hear this? That's <laughs> a bit so much you know that that's <laughs> Nothing against Protestants. I'm all for integration, I am. 
But if they're letting their Wayans divorce them? Macaulay Cogan isn't a Protestant, ma. It's only gonna give our Wayans ideas. You should be driving them, you useless shit. <laughs> I have to work, Joe. Work? <laughs> Is that what you call it? Yes. Why don't you just leave my Mary alone? Because we've been married for 17 <laughs> years, Joe. We have two children. I was going to say, is that his father-in-law? We're in love with each other. I find some dirt in you, yeah, boy. Oh, I've got people yeah. working on it. You should be having a lie in love you on your holidays. First day of term, Sarah. Is it I? It is <laughs> I. Right, so the sisters live, to, they all live together, I assume. I don't know about the rest of you. <laughs> I have an appointment in Tropicana at 12, 15 minutes in the stand-up, but you will not get over the bridge at this rate. Hey! Oh, is that a uh, younger you sister, I your blazer? I've decided to put my own spin on the uniform this year. Well, you're going to get sent home. Across that floor, get your blazer on. Yeah. <laughs> Look, mommy, I'm not a clone. I should be allowed to express my individuality. I'm sorry. To be fair. I'm not wearing my blazer. End of story. We should be allowed to wear like stuff. Pass me the wooden spoon. Oh, bloody hell! I want to take over my mouth. That's something my grandma would say, guys. I'll get the wooden spoon out. <laughs> She never actually used to do it to me. Anything? No, thank so. you aren't I doing this fast for Ethiopia? Well, for Christ's sake, what is it with you in Africa? Will you sponsor me? How much? Two pound. Two pound? Catch yourself on. What's happening over there is really lousy, Erin. Father Conway showed us a video and there's this one wee fella, Kamal. He's only telling <laughs> every morning. I love the Irish accent, well. guys. You just really enjoy Wales, eh? Shut up. From here to Bali Buffet, face, sure you'd be knackered. Kamal is knackered. Are you sure Kamal isn't exaggerating? Look, stop slagging off, Kamal. Kamal does <laughs> You touch them, you buy them. Oh. That's the law. I don't think that is the law. If I say it's the law, it's the law, smart hole. <laughs> right, smart it's just hole. I can't afford them anymore. Have to give all my money to come out. <laughs> Who the fuck's come out? He's away, Ethiopian girl from the Valley Buffet, Dennis. Do you want to sponsor me, Dennis? <laughs> Get out! Who the fuck's come out? David. David Donnelly. Who's Davis? Okay. David just Donnelly. I know. Right. Is this going to be like someone she fancies? <laughs> Here, have you um, got a light? Me? No, I don't smoke. Why the hell do I not smoke? Hey, everyone. I don't smoke either. I just like melt on stuff. <laughs> oh, poster. <laughs> Seriously, you don't need this concert, are you? Gig, Claire, it's called a gig. And I have to go invite me specifically. Motherfuckers! Motherfucker, oh, is my this... thing. Who owns the fella? Me. Well, come on then, Bollock. Are you introducing yourself or what? Oh, I'm Michelle's cousin James. Why is he making that funny noise? He's English, Bless him. that's the way they talk. <laughs> He's meant to Kathy's way. I told you about Mentor Kathy. She Bless went to England him. years ago to have an abortion, never came back. Never got the abortion either. Look at you, James, eh? <gasps> right. I didn't actually know that. Bless him. him. He's actually that's cute. She's a bit of a goer, sorry, Kathy. Rain rings around him, so she was. Isn't that right, James? No, so she was here, shagging. Like, stop. Oh, he's going to our school. Other people. But he's a fella. And a feminine fella, but a fella all the same. Interesting. Avon! Oh, Fuck off! Avon. <laughs> Not Avon! Not Avon! Not Avon! Not Avon, guys. Just move. Alright. Shift to short holes, let's go. Nobody move. Oh! You better do as I say, or. Or what? Or there'll be consequences. Such as. We'll, we'll be. She's up. got nice eyes, though. Really? Michelle. Go on then. Michelle. What? Beat me up. <laughs> <laughs> this is literally what like school, every school, school in the UK Grand, is I'll like. I'll meet you after school and you can beat me up. What's happening what? exactly? <laughs> I'll bring my sister, Mandy. You might know her. Oh. Mandy O'Connell. She's an upper sec. Like Mandy. Like Mandy's your sister? That's right. right. Listen, I think <laughs> there's been a bit of a misunderstanding. <laughs> Thought you might say that. Now fuck off. <laughs> Guys, I'm actually glad this is funny. I need some light-hearted bants after these last few days. Everyone remain seated. Right. What the fuck's going on, right? Yeah. 
What's going on? I don't know. But do you think if I told him I had an incendiary device around my knickers, he'd have a look? <laughs> she has a look, some of them are right. I'm willing to admit it, even if nobody else will. Because I'm a beacon of truth, Erin. You're a mouse. That's what you are. Could I just have a quick chat? No. You must be new. Seriously, shoot me in the face. This is a bit <laughs> awkward, but... Me, every time I showed up at school. Welcoming the first How do you know that already? already? Sages were gonna beat her up. That's lies. There were quite a few witnesses. Lies and Manelli. No, I mean, we said it, but... It's a joke. As in, we're gonna beat you up. But, like, in a jokey way. Right. Well, the thing is... That's not actually funny, is it? Like, at all. Well, humor's so subjective, really, so... The soundtrack, guys! Kinda hitting. Do you think Big Maddie looks more skittle than usual? <laughs> I try to think of it this way. <laughs> oh, like the dear! Are like a little seed. And the school is like the soil. A safe and stable environment within which you can grow. Wow, mm -hmm. what a great way to look at it. Reality, I'm sorry to say, is much harsher, far more brutal. So let me take this opportunity to advise all our new girls to keep their guard up. I'm so glad I never went to an all girls school, guys. Oh, speaking of like, boys are a pain in that, the ass. I'd like to introduce James McGuire. Aww. Show yourself, please, James. I mean, he was due see. to start a Christian Brother Boys, but there were serious concerns for his safety because, well, unfortunately, James happens to be English. <laughs> But let me make one thing clear. I will not have a repeat of the Mr. Mullen affair. Is that understood? What's the Mr. Mullen What's affair? Him? Student teacher. Two fourth years cable tied him to the monkey bars and started dry riding him. He was really good looking, so you have nothing to worry about. Oh, but don't do him dirty like that. He's adorable. It can be. It's my big chance with David. I'd do it for you. But we both know you're just going to sit in the corner like a frigid fuck. Not frigid. You've never even kissed the boy before. You practice on your pillow sometimes, but you don't think that's the same. The reading of the diary is bad enough. I could do without the quoting it from memory. Michelle, would you mind showing me where the toilet is? It was attempted bullying. What if we get expelled? I can't find the boys' toilets anywhere. It's an all girls' yeah. school, duck face. There are no boys' toilets. So should I just use the girls' toilets? Well, you you're gonna have to. Fuck a pervert. Yes. <laughs> Guys, I feel sort of shaky. I think my blood sugar's down. That's because you've not eaten anything all day. Just like a Mars bar. What about Kumail? Fuck Kumail. <laughs> Look, whatever happens in the night, we have to stick together. Okay, we have to back each other Ladies, fuck Kumail. <laughs> Mandy's her sister and she's half fucking gorilla. That's quite <laughs> fucking hell. It's all just a misunderstanding. Bloody hell. I promise, sister. Is that right, Tina? Was it a misunderstanding? Look, I didn't even report them. I'm not a grass. I'm saying nothing. Is that because you're intimidated by them? <laughs> no. Oh, you're serious? <laughs> no, I'm not intimidated by them, sister. Yeah. Sister Michael, can I just quickly ask? Um, since there's no male student toilets on the premises am i permitted to use the staff ones absolutely not now i think you all owe tina an apology don't you <laughs> we're very sorry, very tina. sorry i don't suppose you oh do my God. No. then i don't i don't accept it so they're all in detention now i'm listening david tomley's gig michelle and all because of that manager motherfucker i swear if he's a <sighs> motherfucker one more time what's wrong with you this is your fault. <laughs> Why is it my fault? You're the one who threatened the first year. I'm desperate now. This is agony. Don't tell me you pissed Can you please stop crying in my face for five fucking minutes, James? <laughs> I feel awful. <laughs> you better not have brought my diary to school. I had to. I'm doing my book report on it. Oh, Damn it! Damn it! What's going on there, girl? She has oh, my diary, no. sister, and she won't give it back. I'll take that. You have been warned. Do not ask me again. This is disgraceful. I should it have is. access to a laboratory. What about my civil rights? That's... Corner. Let him use the fucking toilet. Oh, look. Your boring fucking diary sent you to sleep. <laughs> I'm taking my lipstick back. Oh, I'm pissing in the disgusting. Stop it. That's English for you fucking savages. <laughs> he needs the toilet. 
Oh my god, guys. I'm stressed. Oh. Right. Well, to be fair, it's he could have just pissed on the floor. He chose to piss in a bucket. And no one would let him use the bathroom. Oh, what in God's name? Did you kill that wee nun, girls? Of course we didn't. Then why were you pissing on her dead body and making sandwiches? Sorry. Sorry, I'm late, sister. Couldn't get over the bridge, this bloody bomb. I begged the Brits to let me take my chances, but the awkward bastards made me go the long way. Excuse me? Mad, what are you playing at? Rifling through a dead nun's handbag. <laughs> She's doing a lipstick, Maui. Don't lie. Sister Declan was a woman of God. Actually, she was known to be a bit light-fingered. She's way back to London. What, without me? Oh, dry your eyes, James. Bless him. Sorry to keep you waiting, sister. Guys. How long does it take to defuse a fucking bomb? Sure, the wee robots do all the work. Oh, killing nuns now, is it? I didn't, Daddy. Did you tell your mother hears about this? Obviously, Sister <laughs> Declan's death was extremely shocking and unexpected. <laughs> We're still struggling to understand exactly what happened. <laughs> yeah. Can I just... Oh. Might that shed some light on the situation? <laughs> How so? Well, Does anybody else have any thoughts on the whole her being almost 98 years of age thing? Struck down her prey. The hospital are saying right. it was heart failure. But I have my doubts. What? As I said on the phone. The, the bitch was... Not the bitch, her sorry. Were the woman was 98 years old. So I decided old. to carry out a full investigation into the incident. Don't tell me the that fucking diary sense. killed her or something. See me, yeah. Like How reading her diary. Makes sense. The woman was almost 98 years of age. She had a heart attack. <laughs> Why is everybody going absolutely mental? Let's see the cheek, Aaron. I can't do anything. It's not fair. But the thing <clears throat> is, life isn't fair. Surrounded by conflict. The path to peace is paved with tolerance and understanding. Violence. Is never the answer. <laughs> I'm going to ram that <laughs> so far up your heart! <laughs> Wait, pause. Oh my god. Right, guys, I'm loving this so far. Fucking hell, this is so funny. <laughs> <coughs> Bloody hell. Guys, this is hilarious so far. Um, yeah, I can't wait to watch the next one. <laughs> next episode. Um, I'm loving the characters so far. They're all quite funny. Obviously, I think it's going to take me a little bit to learn all the names and whatnot. Um, poor James. I bless him. What? <laughs> His mum's just left him again. Oh god, right, so she's, she came back to Ireland um, and then basically left him there. Right, because she can't be bothered. He's at an all-girls school where he can't use the toilet because people have a problem with it, which, can I just say, just let him use the fucking bathroom, right? He's, he's not gonna he's not gonna attack anybody also they won't even let him use a staff toilet do you know what good on him for pissing in a bucket i've got no qualms with it if they're not letting him use the toilet fuck it i would have i would have pissed on them to be honest um <laughs> i wouldn't have blamed him um yeah they're all very funny i'm enjoying it um uh, i don't know what else to say really but for a first episode it was pretty fucking good um and yeah i can't wait to watch the next one if you did enjoy this reaction to the first episode please leave a like subscribe if you need uh the full unedited reaction will be over on patreon at some point um probably before you see this because i tried to get everything out on patreon first so make sure to go check that out if you want to and check out all my other social media links down below i'm probably gonna go watch episode two now um and yeah, guys, thank you so much. Love you all lots. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.